सो हेलो एवरीबडी टूडे वी शैल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट बारग्राफ सो फर्स्ट लेट इज टॉक अबाउट वॉट इज अ बारग्राफ सो दे से दैट अ बारग्राफ इज द रिप्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ न्यूमेरिकल डेटा सो यू कैन यू पीपल कैन सी दैट दिस इज द न्यूमेरिकल डेटा द फॉलोइंग टेबल शोज द पॉपुलेशन ऑफ अ पर्टिकुलर सिटी इन डिफरेंट ईयर्स सो इन ईयर 1996 the population was 45 lakhs so the population is written in lakhs similarly in 2001 it is 57 2006 70 2011 90 and 2016 is 110 lakhs so this population are in lakhs and we have to represent this this particular table isn't it this particular numerical data in the form of rectangles rectangles of equal width and varying height so let me write equal width equal width with varying height varying height so now it is very very clear that when we will draw the bar graph or each of the bar that is each of the rectangle should have equal width so the first step is to draw x axis and y axis x axis and y axis y axis should be drawn this x axis is your horizontal line so you can see that this is my x axis okay this is my x axis you shall be using a sharpened pencil this is a pen okay sharpened pencil so this is my x axis which is a horizontal line now this horizontal line this horizontal line is your x axis and an arrow should be put over here this is your x axis similarly when it is your x axis so you should mark it with capital x now let's draw the vertical axis so this is my vertical axis okay please come let's draw this vertical axis i have drawn this vertical axis and again i will have to put the arrow sign and i will mark it as y capital y so i have both the axis x axis and y axis clear after marking it as x axis and y axis the second step is to name name the axis name the axis a x e s so axis and axis becomes axis okay name the axis so here these all bar graph this all bar graph that is the rectangle will be drawn over here okay on the x axis so when you will draw the these all on the x axis then the name of these all rectangles should be in year so the year will come over here and all the values are generally written in uh, uh, written in the in in this column or in the vertical axis that is the y axis so here you people can see that here i am going on y axis i am going to take population okay i am going to take population in lakhs so i will write population in lakhs clear so i have named y axis as population in lakhs similarly in x axis it will be our years that is different years different years so x axis will resemble different years and while y axis population in lakhs so population in lakhs you can see that these are numbers 45 57 70 90 110 therefore the third most important thing is choosing a scale choosing a scale if you do not choose a particular scale 
and do not write the scale over here no marks will be will be awarded clear so let us choose a scale so i think that these all values 45 57 70 90 and 110 and 110 okay and 110 let's see where is my scale where have i put my scale so i i shall start from here okay 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110. However, let's see what, what will happen. So let us take a scale that 1 centi, see this is your 1 centimeter, isn't it? 1 centimeter length. So this 1 centimeter length has 10 divisions. Okay, let me zoom it a little. So you people can see that this 1 centimeter length this one centimeter length has 10 divisions 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 it has 10 divisions therefore i'll take my scale as what am i going to take my scale i'll take my scale as one centimeter is one centimeter should be equal to 10 units i'll take the scale so i will write the scale over here where, where should i write i'll write over here scale no i'll write scale as scale my scale is one centimeter equal to 10 units okay or 10 units or you can say 10 lakhs l a k h s it's better we'll I'll write i'll write one centimeter is equal to 10 lakh now this first division so this first length isn't it this first width should be left empty and after one centimeter you will start our marking from here so now let us take since i have taken one centimeter is equal to 10 lakh so this will be my 10 lakh 20 lakhs 30 40 50 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, oh my god, 110 came over here. Since I do not have enough space, I'll mark it, I mark 110 over there only. Come on. So now, what they say, they say that population in 1996 was 45. So let us see, this is my 10. 20 30 40 45 comes over here so when 45 comes over here you will use a scale and draw this rectangle draw this rectangle and what is the name of this particular bar it is what is the name of this the name of this is 1996 so i will write 1996 over you can write 1996 over here clear similarly we have 57 in 2001 so again you will leave one of one centimeter and again we shall take 57 so 57 will come over here have a look where 57 will come this is my 50 this is my 50 and then 57 55 and i will take two more units this is my 50 55 and two more unit it will become 57 clear come on Hmm. So, 50, 55 and I will take two more divisions, 57, yes, 55, 56, 50, 57, okay, there might be slight error, slight error, but I hope you have understood my feelings, no, <laughs> nothing to do with the feeling, even a slight error will lead you to problem okay see name this name this as 2001 2001 similarly 70 so 70 is very easy again i will leave one of them one of uh, one centimeter and then i'll take 70 this is my 70 so 70 hello uh -huh. this is my 70 lakhs 70 lakhs in which year so 70 lakh in 
year 2006 2006 2011 we had 90 oh uh -huh. so 2011 we had 90 where is 90 90 is over here so this graph also shows that as the year increased as the year increased the population kept on increasing isn't it as the year kept on increasing the population also increased so this is this is my 2002011 2011 so in 2011 our population was 90 while in 2016 it becomes 110 so let us draw this 110 110 comes over here it comes over here so i am going to use this particular i don't have any options so please forgive me because i had used this space in writing these steps i didn't know that it will cover this particular region however i hope you people can understand it very clearly that this is 2016 so what did we find we found that this is a simple bar graph in which there is an x axis which should be marked x x and y with arrows secondly you will have to name the axis different years and all the data should be written over here before you write the data you have to choose a scale the scale is here i since looking at the data i can see that 1 cm equal to 10 lakh so i have taken 1 cm as 10 lakh looking at this i drew all these rectangular bars which shows which shows different years different years with different with different years with different population isn't it different different population and here you can clearly see that the population is increasing i hope this video might help you a lot if possibly for all the classes